Hello everyone, welcome back to Nisi's Customs. Today I'm going to be showing everyone how to take these two pictures that I snapped of my Christmas ornaments and make templates. But before we begin, how about do me a favor, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you won't miss any of my videos. And please, can you hit the like button after you finish if you like my videos and drop me a comment section. A comment in the comment section I'll be very happy and that also help my channel out as well okay as you can see I have my two um, pictures images that I took with my phone and what you want to do they were turned sideways but I just turn them you know upright like like that and what you want to do, you want to go over here and you want to go to your tracing tool over here and you're going to hit select trace area. Then you're going to come and you're going to trace the your image that you took. Look at this thing right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. I hope that stays. Let me bring this down. You want to make sure that you cover the whole area, the whole image. Okay. Once you got that, it should highlight. Once you got it all highlight, let me see if I can at least scrape it out some. Let me see. Oh, don't want to do that. Let me go back up. Okay. Once you got that highlighted around your image, you want to go ahead and hit trace. Once that has been traced, Go ahead and move that to the side. You want to right click on your image and hit delete because you don't need that anymore. You want to go ahead and do the, I'm going to go ahead and do the other image. Okay, then I'm going to go up a little bit more, then I'm going to hit trace, move this image out the way, delete this. Okay, now since you have your image trace, what you want to do is you're going to get, you're going to try to get, you're going to get rid of the square. So you want to click the image, you want to right click, hit release, then you're going to click the square, you want to delete it. Let me go back and show you that again. I'm going to go ahead and do this the right way so y'all can get it. Okay, you're going to right click, you're going to hit release compound path, going to click that. Once you do that, you're going to see these, you're going to see your image, you're going to see another box come up and another com another box come up where you have like little details so what you want to do is click the first box where well, the first the square where you want to get rid of you want to right click and you want to hit delete you want to come and you want to gather all this stuff right here together including the little hole that's right there on your um, ornament then you're going to right click 
then you're going to hit group. Okay. You got your first template right here. Then you're going to do the same thing with your jingle bells. Release compound path. Take that box out. Hit delete. You're going to gather all this right here. And you're going to hit, um, either you can hit group or you can hit make compound, make compound path. But I always hit group because groups and every get grouping everything together. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to um, take your template. Well, I have the. I, I didn't measure the jingle bells, so I have to measure the jingle bells, but I measured the um, the stocking. And your stocking should be three, three by 3.5. So, you know, you come over here. That's um, open the transform panel. Then going to hit the scale and I have to play around with this so it's going to be three and the height is going to be 3.5 and y'all know what I did wrong you know exactly what I did wrong I didn't even highlight the I didn't even highlight the image okay let's do this again so it's going to be three and the height is going to be 3.5 and you're going to hit apply okay and that is your image that's the height the width that's your template right there that is your template and let me see if i can get the template for the jing Sorry about that, guys. I had to get a phone call that was by my mother. Um, but now we have the jingle bell, not the jingle bell, but the stocking template. We're going to go ahead and do the jingle bells. We're going to go ahead and size that up. And the measurements for the jingle bell template is going to be 2.36. And 2.95. I'm gonna apply that. So didn't change much, but um, let me do this again. Two, three point. Create the computer, y'all. This thing know it be showing off. And it get good and this thing. Okay. I'ma do the two point nine five up here. And the uh, 2.36 right there. Okay, we're gonna leave it like that. So that is your template for your jingle bell and your template for the stockings. And if y'all got any other templates that y'all want to learn how to make, just leave um leave it in the comment section. Please leave it in the comment section. Y'all just don't know how much y'all help my channel out if y'all just leave stuff in the comment section and hit the like button or even subscribe. And that is it. And I will be giving y'all another video pretty soon when I make my ornaments.
Peace.